back on the fucking track. Every time you cross my mind, it hit different It seems like since you left, I feel like something is missing Ain't been the same, I've been hurting This got me up in my feelings I know you watch it, so I pray And I just hope that you listen I wanna say that I miss you hey. Yo guys, Confused here So today I'm showing you how to do the intro and hear this song Um, so basically what I've already done I just put the music in and marked the beat drops Um Yeah, now I'm putting in the Oh now I'm deleting the songs. Basically, what I'm doing now, I'm just I'm just clipping the thing where I wanted to have it dropped. Yeah, and make sure you end it on the beat drops that it's like going to the next one. Really nice. Now click Control B, then you can just uh, yeah cut that. Yeah, that looks really nice. I'm putting in this one, deleting this. Okay, what you want to do now is you want to go to effects on the left thing here, then you click and dropping in the fusion composition. Then you click on the fusion, uh, fusion composition and control B to cut that. Then what I'm doing, I'm always doing this to 10. Then put this on this, then go to fusion. Then go to then click the background, click text, click merge, and now click control space. Then you are uh, searching displays. And then drop shadow. So then you're going on the background, doing the alpha to zero. If you're not doing that, everything's not working, so make sure you have that. And now just follow like everything on top of that. Okay, then you can click on text and like write highlight hashtag one. Then click the font you needed to download. I am um, it's in the description there. And then I'm just connecting all of those. Just follow basically everything I'm doing there. Then you can see the font. It's like when you're downloading the font, just click on the link, download it, restart DaVinci, then you have it on your font list. Yeah, then it should be there. It's like the smartphone pro I showed with the logos it's exactly the same okay then you're going and drop shadow and now you can choose like the shadow you want on it i like uh the shadows branch on 1.0 then this on 35 then this on 2.2 and this on 2.99 i mean 299 yeah i don't care like this like that. so basically and then you're going uh, on your files and then you're dragging and dropping in the displacement map it's in my google drive folder so just download both then you're going to connect the um, displacement map it's called median median one you connect it into the displays then you're going on the displays then you go into the type to x and y yeah then x refraction Point, uh, you do it on 0 0.002 and uh, this one too, I don't know the words. So when you've done it, this should look like this. Yeah, and 
that's basically it and we're just doing this now for every clip um yeah i think i'm speeding this up Basically, like, uh, what the fuck? Basically, guys, I think I'm not speeding this up. So then you can see how you're doing it a couple of times. And yeah, it's just it's just basically always the same. Alpha on zero, then you put in drop shadow, media out, displace, merge, then connect everything. You can do it like you want. You can do everything first, like with the settings, and then connect it. But I don't know. Then edit it by, and this is what people ask me about. Now I'm always doing like six bases one, two, three, four, five, six. Then I'm doing this one, I don't know the word, and then you're doing six spaces again one, two, three, four, five, six. Then I put in um, confuse. And I'm showing you right now why I'm doing this. And I'm adding my drop shadow. Mm, 299. And this. Displacement map. Displace. Okay. And now it's looking like this. And yeah, now I'm changing something. Now I'm adding another fusion composition uh, at the back. Now I'm dragging this up to this one. Now I'm ending this there. Doing this to 10. And this to 10. I'm doing that to add the social media logos. So sometimes you need to go and edit and fusion a couple of times that it's seeing that you want to go on this because if not it's adding another background on the other one we just did and then it's just not working i don't know that's a bit weird so background there text shadow media out this place merge connect everything Then we're doing T, 1, 2, 3, and an L. Then we're taking the font, who, uh, which was in my last video, where I showed to, uh, where I showed to do the, the logos. Then we're just clicking the font. Then we're doing, uh, doing the size on, on 5.9 or 6. Then we're adding the drop shadow. 
2.2.299. By the way, sorry for my bad English. It's like, I don't know, it's okay, but it's not the best sometimes. I just don't know the words. Then you're going, uh, no, we're not doing that. We're going on our files, then adding the displacement map. Going to displays, x, y, 0 0.02, and 0 0.002. Uh, yeah, you know what I mean. And now it's looking like this, and now we can change here the on the composite the position, and we're just putting it there where we want it to. Um, I still don't like uh, the house of cold size yet, so I'm putting it a little bit lower. Bring it more to there, and I think that should look nice. And yeah, and now I'm doing the same with the where it says use code. Just cutting it there. Doing this to ten. This to ten. This there, put it down. This there. Okay. Make sure you don't select one of of those things because that's not working. Then click edit infusion a couple of times. And add everything. So background to this, drop shadow, media out, displays, merge, connect everything. It's like always the same, it's not that true. Then text, we're doing hashtag AD. Oh what the fuck? This happening always. Hashtag it. And we're taking the font Dimbo. Making the size like uh, like this, that should be good. Then drop shadow, same settings. Um, at the displacement map, change the type to X and Y. And 0 0.002, 0 0.002. And now it looks like this, but we can change the on the composite the opacity. So we can do it like like we want it, like yeah, you know what I mean. Let's do it like you want it to be. And make sure to click Control and S sometimes. I didn't do that because the winter crashes sometimes and then you have saved everything. And now it should look like this. So guys, this was basically it. Um, this was the intro. Um, yeah, soon I'm doing a new video um, to a new tutorial where you can do like uh, nice effects. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Um, see you in the next one.